Hello everyone, thank you for watching. Hope you're all okay. Um, I just wanted to mention first of all, because I forgot last time I thought I'd get it in there first. Um, if you could all hit the thumbs up button down below to give the video a like and also to hit subscribe if you want to see our future videos, that would be great. Thank you very much. Now that that's out of the way, I just wanted to share with you a little, only a small win that Toby and I had today, but you know, I, I just know that you guys will get it. So we've been practicing going out without the push chair because Toby's out now and he's a very tall, very broad little boy. So I mean, he's a, he's a big lad. He's like about the size of a 12 year old. And at the moment we use a mountain buggy. Um, we are, we're reaching a, a point now really where we either need a proper disability push chair or he needs to start doing without it, which it's a bit, it's one of those things where he's more comfortable in it when we go anywhere it's a bit like his safe place when we go anywhere but he's able to walk so we've been practicing going into the shops we've always just going one shop i've been going on for quite some time now we're going to one shop um we started off with a cart so he could buy some sweets because i knew he'd like that but today we went into two shops today i've been to next and then to boots both sort of fairly quick visits, obviously don't hang around too long because I know that he, um, you know, I know that it stresses him out, I know that he's not going to gonna be up to doing it for too long at the moment, but I'm still absolutely over the moon, just with that bit of progress today, so I just wanted to share that with you all, first of all. Um, the purpose of the video today is because we've been playing with a two cam box, Toby was, um, it was a gift. Um, it was a gift from Toby's auntie and uncle from Madison and JJ's mum and dad. All three kids had one. Um, and me and Toby have been playing with his today and we just had loads of fun. So I thought I'd share it with you because it's, if you're anything like me, you'll, you'll be looking for things by now. Whether your kids are, are autistic or NT, you'll be looking for things by now to keep them occupied over the six weeks holiday because they just need constant attention, don't they, and cleaning up. And they, I love all the kids I do, they're my absolute world, but if I sweep up another flat turtle being off that floor, guys, <laughs> I can't promise. <laughs> um, Toby likes really like sensory activities, really. He, he he likes, he's a constant um tactile sensory seeker. He likes to feel everything too much, really. Um, he likes, he likes like lentils and he very likes flat turtle beans a whole lot. If anybody else has got a sensory seeker and you've not tried those, there's another little tip for you. They're like, I'll have to show you someone in another video, but they're like little pea-sized, smooth jet black beans and Toby really, really likes them. Just to like stream and they're good. Like we do some rides and stuff like that with them. So they, you know, they're something that we play with, but they're also something that I clean up a whole lot. Anyway, Toby was... We received a two-can box from Toby's auntie and uncle in the post and we had a little go in it today and it was just loads of fun. And you know, I really thought to myself, before we started to pack, oh, I wonder what his concentration's going to be like because he will, like, he will engage with you and he will sit and try, try anything that you ask him to try really, but if he's not enjoying it, it doesn't last very long. But actually, we were playing with it for about an hour. Playing with it for about an hour, I would say. Um, the activity that we were doing was making a spider. Um, <laughs> we made a. We were, what we were supposed to do was make a spider's web in a tray. And then we had like a marble and some white paint, and you had to shake it around the tray to get all the white, all around, all the white paint all around the tray. But the, the, I mean, the first thing that we got out of the box was some pipe cleaners for making the. Spider with so that just caught his attention straight away. It's tactile sensory, so he was loving feeling those. But I did actually manage to get his attention quite well, and that was something that I just really loved about it. I felt like it was a really good balance. Both both activities in the box were like had a sensory aspect, a tactile sensory aspect to them. So um, whether you kids are into or autistic or particularly really for less able children. 
it was or was I able to get those moments of concentration from him because it, that sensory aspect to what we were doing was there as well. So you could really sort of see him. You could see like moments of concentration in between streaming the pipe cleaners and stuff. And he did. He actually did do the the activity that I was asking him to do. Um, I'm just looking down because I've written it down on my piece of paper so as I don't ramble on for too long. But we, um, basically, first of all, we had to rip paper to make a spider and stick it, which Toby did do. He did, um, he, he did what he was asked to do to give us what I was doing, and he, he stuck his bits of ripped paper to the spider. Um, right. Look, can you rip that one? Can you rip that for me? Mm. Can you rip it? Rip it for mum. Look, like this. Right, mummy, rip it. Mm. And Toby, you rip this one for mummy. I know you like those, but just rip that for me. Rip it. Rip. Oh. Oh. Good. And again, just gap it. Perfect. Good. Right, now. Now we have to put the glue on here. Make it sticky with kids. Can you stick it all on there now, Toby? Come on. Right, Mummy, look. Stick. Can you stick yours on there? Good. Good. Well done. Oh, it's gorgeous. Should we do the other side as well? Because we've got some left. Um, he, he, I mean, he was following, he do, Toby does understand pretty much everything that you say. So, I mean, he does follow instructions quite well anyway, but verbal instructions quite well anyway as long as he's in a quiet environment but it was just a bit more I suppose it was a bit different for us than what you know we were usually I'd be getting the same old activities and puzzles out whereas this was just completely new and different things that I'd never asked him to do before like at one point you had to like pierce the spider with like a needle thing and pull the leg through which Toby did do is he you <laughs> gonna have a go do this You've got to pull that, pull it, Toby, pull it through, pull, pull. Oh, you have to be strong, boy, to do that one, don't you? Perfect. And this one, can I have one another one of those, please? I'm gonna have not done it yet. Put it in there. Okay, now you pull, 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 pull. <laughs> the stick. That's it. Oh, oh, it's hard, isn't it? Oh, oh you did it. You're so important. There we go. Right. Boys have to have eight legs down the toes. Oh, God. Is it, when I was looking, when I was looking for the spider's eyes, he took the web apart and he pulled the spider's legs off. But you know, like, that it, now it's just like a freestyle bespoke spider that's that has no legs so i just thought that was quite cool anyway and you know whatever floats his boat really <laughs> so um anyway he'd like a let me stick it in right where's the eyes gone now here they are we have to stick all the eyes on or what i need to spare What's the box? What's the two can box or? Oh yes. So what have we got to do with paint? Oh! Good idea. Right. Let's do this then. Hang on. Let me find my scissors. This is the finished article that's our spider it took us an hour to make i'm sure you'll agree it's an absolute masterpiece most likely will list it on ebay for a couple of million at some point because it's a tobernizer original uh, but yeah i'm going to keep that along with everything else that we've ever made together because that's just how we roll in this house i will i'll put the link to the toucan information underneath if anybody's interested in giving it a go or having a work, I'm not too sure whether it's, um, I think you can have a, why do I always say prescription when I mean subscription? There's something wrong with me. 
I think it's something that you can have a subscription for, whether the price differs or anything like that, I'm not sure. You'd have to go onto the website and have a little look because, as I say, it was a, a gift that Toby received that I just wanted to let you know about because he absolutely loved it. So, um, if I can just remind you all again, please give me a thumbs up down below and click the subscribe button. And hopefully, I'll see you again soon with something else exciting. Thanks a lot. You get all them ones on for me then. That's it, hook it. Make it a hook like this, I'll show you ready. Good. Next one. Good. Next one. Good. Now we've got to hook these ones on there. That's going to make our tidy web. As long as we don't make the hooks out of these. Oh no way, where's it gone? <laughs> we have to keep that together, that's our pointer. Right. Glue the paper onto right. This is gonna be our pointer. Right, so we go come on. Sit down, sit down, good boy, got to his eyes on, look, one, can you do this one, can you stick this one on from there, no it's a bit fiddly but can you have a go, good, go on play, look at that spider now, look how cool he is now, he doesn't even need any legs, he looks amazing, right, I'm 100% convinced I'm up for this bit though but you know what, I'm sure I've cleaned up worse messes than this at some point, so we'll see. Right, now, put your, put your strings in the, in the tray, put them in there, in the powder, put your strings in there. These, put these in. Good boy, good boy. And the powder, look, and now put this in. And now you've got to put this in. Look, it's the marble. Ready? Hey! Shake, shake, shake your feet Baby elephant, come down the tree. What do you think about that then? Oh, he just got a little bit, oh, his eyes fell off. Oh, dear, dear. Then I'm going to keep this pointer. I think you've done a lovely job of that. I'll give that a nan, she'll love that. It's cool, isn't it? What's the daisy? Do you get some more? Thank <laughs> you.